Utilizing creativity in your work and monetizing your skills is the key to earning money online as a photographer by marketing your images online. What if I say you can earn a pretty good amount of bucks by selling your stock photos and videos? Yes, exactly, you heard it right. There are such websites on the internet that pays you for stock photos and videos. In this video, we will discuss the top 5 websites to sell your stock photos and videos to earn money. So buckle up and let's jump straight into the video. If you know where to sell your images online, you can easily earn additional money as a photographer. More than ever, there is a considerable need for the work of photographers of all ability levels. Everybody buys and uses photos online. It includes big firms, small and medium-sized enterprises, bloggers, graphic designers, advertisers, and publishers. Bloggers and small to medium-sized online company owners make up most of the stock photo market. Before moving ahead, you should know what type of stock photos and videos are trending and sell at higher rates. So most companies and websites buy photos from all nations, cultures, children, adults, and everyone. So naturally, businesses love to see these pictures of people doing some work. Other than that, people write on laptops, speak at meetings, etc. Avoid making them so generic that they can become a meme. Why different varieties of delectable dishes are left empty? Tools like hammers, bolts, nuts, and screws can say a lot to potential customers. That is a no-brainer that is always interesting to photograph or sell. Also, images from different parts of the world are always in demand. One of the most common ways to market your images online to businesses, publishers, or anybody else who might be interested in utilizing them for their purposes is through licensing. This is crucial, after all. Consider how a business or media might use your photographs as you return from that point. I know you are craving to see those websites where you can market your photos and videos, right? Well, let me get you straight to website number one. On number one, we have 500px. Through its stock photography website, 500px licensing supports millions of photographers who sell images online. In addition, over a million clients are served by its distribution partners, who are the top source for original content. All content uploaded to the website is royalty-free, meaning its use is granted for a continuous period and is charged according to the file size. The community-based site for amateur and expert photographers is 500px. You can follow other photographers, sell your images on their websites, and participate in PhotoQuest contests to win rewards. For non-exclusive photos, you will receive a 30% commission payment and up to 60% royalties. In addition, this free website has a pulse algorithm that raises your visibility by putting your new posts on a discovery page, which thousands of people see every day. Additionally, the website offers statistics and monitoring services so you can compare the performance of your photographs to those of your rivals. You might be wondering how many people click on your pictures. What about your standing among your peers? You can find the answers to your most pressing issues on 500px. An internet marketplace called 500px enables you to build an image portfolio and make money. It is among the top websites for selling pictures online. Starting on 500px is relatively easy. Create a free account and upload your pictures. Then watch to see what comes up. Keep an eye out for contests to increase your earnings and visibility. Moving next to number 2, here comes Shuttershock. Online stock photo purchases have been made on Shuttershock for over 15 years. They offer more than 200 million royalty-free photos, movies, and music files, implying that they have millions of paying customers. With this market, you can eventually make money as a photographer. According to its website, Shutterstock merchants have reportedly earned over $500 million globally. Although you shouldn't anticipate making as much money here, it's a fantastic place to start if you're new to selling stock images. You control the rights to your photographs thanks to Shutterstock, which enables you to maintain your copyright protection. Another significant benefit that safeguards your ownership and promotes your brand is that Shutterstock offers credit to the image's creators. As soon as you sign up to contribute to the site, you can start getting paid whenever someone buys and downloads your stuff. Depending on the number of times the clients download your content at the end of each month, producers can make anywhere from 15 to 40 percent. It might not always be a good thing that Shutterstock is highly known in the industry. Popular stock photography websites are renowned for making it harder for new, young photographers to make a living. It's still worthwhile to try posting and promoting your work on the Shutterstock marketplace because you are not restricted to only selling through their system. Let's come to number 3, which is Etsy. 
You might not consider Etsy while looking for sites to sell stock photographs because it is more known as a forum for buying and selling one-of-a-kind handmade goods. However, Etsy promises more than 30 million members and several opportunities for you to sell your images on its website. Etsy has a massive advantage over other stock picture websites because it has a wider readership and a customer base eager to buy your photos. Of course, you can sell prints in addition to digital photographs on Etsy. So, Etsy is a terrific choice if you want to grow your photography business even more. Opening a photography store on Etsy could be a terrific alternative if you want to sell images online. It's simple to get started since prints may be sold immediately and because experienced and new photographers can benefit from the cost structure. Only 5% of the total transaction price, which incorporates the shipping price you choose, is retained by Etsy. After a print is sold, Etsy Payments also takes a 3% plus 25 cent payment processing fee from the sale. The main distinction between Etsy and other online photo marketplaces is that few visitors come looking for stock photos. You'll want to make investments in your store's designs and marketing to get the most out of Etsy. Also, remember to account for printing, packaging, and shipping expenses when selling prints. You may set your prices on Etsy and have complete control over how customers see your photographs. Etsy can be a fantastic choice if you want complete control over your image selling but don't want to build your website from the beginning. If you are enjoying watching this video, make sure to give it a huge thumbs up. Make sure to smash like, share, and subscribe buttons for more. Let's get back to the video. Now, moving on to number 4, we have Alami. Alami is another excellent marketplace for selling stock photographs because there aren't any strict guidelines. With more than 215 million stock photos, vectors, videos, and 360-degree panoramic pictures, Alami has the most extensive varied collection of stock photos worldwide. Everything from ordinary photos to specialty products can be sold. Over 110,000 customers and over 60,000 contributors from around the world use this platform. Additionally, it provides the Stockimo app, where you can market iPhone pictures and make additional money with your selfies. Although the site may not have as many customers as Shutterstock and Adobe Stock, it is nonetheless a strong competitor and a fantastic source of income. Photographers don't need a license or face any other copyright problems when they post their images to Alami. Alami has paid up to $180 million to their participating photographers as of this writing. It's one of the most well-known locations to sell photographs since you may profit from each sale at a startling 40%. Getting started as an Alami contributor is easy. First, you must apply before uploading your initial three photographs for review. After that, you can use Alami's online interface to upload up to 500 pictures at once after they have been approved. Without ever using credits or memberships, Alami offers a straight purchase alternative. Any purchases of photos are made in US dollars, euros, or British pounds since they believe people can buy Alami stock photographs rather than credits. With this online billing model, prices are transparent, license charges are simple to understand, and customers can purchase as needed. Last but not least, we have Adobe Stock. One of the finest venues to sell images online for no cost is Adobe Stock, since when you offer photos for sale there, they are also made available on Photolia, a stock photography website. You may upload your photos, films, vectors, or graphics to Adobe Stock straight from Adobe Lightroom CC, Adobe Bridge CC, and the web if you previously used the Adobe Suite for other creative endeavors. You'll appreciate Adobe Stock's more significant royalty share than other online retailers the most. In addition, photos posted to Photolia are added to the Adobe Stock library, making them accessible to millions of Adobe users and potential customers through other Adobe programs. Adobe Stock pays contributors anything between 20 and 60 percent. Additionally, in contrast to other markets, Adobe Stock does not need you to grant them the sole right to sell your photographs. You can, therefore, simultaneously sell on Adobe Stock and other channels. Given the size of Adobe, it's probable that Adobe Stock will keep on growing in popularity as a top location for stock photography buyers and sellers. So, don't be shy if you believe you have what it needs to be a photographer. It's time to monetize your passion. The only drawback to becoming a contributor to the Adobe Stock Network is that you'll be up against some of the best photographers around the globe. So, which of these websites do you love the most and want to sell your stock photos and videos? Do let us know in the comments below. Make sure to support us by liking, sharing, and subscribing to our channel.
Also, please turn on the post notifications so that you never miss out on any video we upload on this channel. That's all for today's video, until next time!